I believe demons will try to ruin godly relationships. What do I mean by godly relationships? Relationships in which the people are making God the center focus. For an example, let me use a name, Joe. Joe and I are coming together to read and pray. I feel that demons will try to destroy any godly relationship. If you want a godly relationship to work, I think at least one person has to be willing to bow down. What do I mean by bow down? I feel that at least one person has to be submissive. If I am being rude to you and you are being rude to me, how will it work? Let's say you and I are having a disagreement. If I am not willing to back down and you aren't either, how can the relationship work? I believe the relationship will fail. In my opinion, someone has to back down. Let's say you and I are in a godly relationship. Let's say demons begin causing confusion between the two of us in the effort of trying to get us to separate. What if we are willing to stay patient and loving toward each other? What if we are willing to not argue and peacefully talk about what is happening? What if we don't allow anger to overtake us? What if we choose to carefully choose our, our words and not say everything that comes to our mind? How can the demons accomplish what they are trying to do. I don't think they would be able to. You may be the one who is backing down often. It may not be a good feeling for you. If a person continues to back down, I feel God will step in and fix the situation. Some people may be doing wrong and feel they are right by doing it. Some people may be doing wrong and not know that they are doing wrong. If you are willing to yield, I feel God will communicate to the person you are having an issue with. Perhaps sometime later, later, that person may come back and apologize to you. I believe we all make mistakes and don't believe yourself to be better than anyone. Stay humble. Let me stop here. God bless you.